Hi everyone and welcome back to the Organized Notebook. In this video, we wanted to show you how to export your Notion pages to PDF. This is super useful for resumes or invoices and more. We'll be showing you two ways to do this. So let's get started. So the first way we're going to show you how to export to PDF is by going to any Notion page and clicking the three dots on the right hand side. And then you can go to export here and you can choose the format to PDF and it gives you a few options. So it asks if you want to include databases and what this means is if you choose current view, it's going to show you the filters that the database has and then default view would just include everything in the database. Then the next choice you have is everything or no files or images and everything will also download the image files. And if you choose no files or images, it's not gonna add any images, but actually in the PDF, you're going to see an empty box for where the image was. So we highly recommend just getting everything. And then you have the option for A4, A3 letter legal or tabloid. So that's up to you. And then we have the scale percentage here. And we recommend 100% because now Notion actually shifts everything to the left-hand side, which we realized recently. So in the past, we recommended to scale down the, the PDF in order to export well. But now that it shifts to the left, we recommend 100%. And now we have also include subpages, which is in the business plan. So if you had pages inside that you also wanted to export at the same time, this could be done if you have the business plan and it will create folders for the sub pages if you have this plan. So let's go ahead and export this resume by hitting export. And now you can see what it looks like. So as you can see, everything pretty much came out the way that we wanted it to in terms of the formatting. And in order to export well, we recommend that you have minimal pictures so that things don't start to get distorted. And you cannot really change these margins on the left and right side as well as the top. So just keep that in mind as you design your pages if you want it to be optimal for exporting. So as you can see, Notion doesn't allow you too many customization options when it comes to layouts for exporting, which is why we also wanted to show you another option, which is to do a full page screen capture and then cut off the top part. So in order to do a full page screen capture, we are going to be using a Chrome extension called full page screen capture. We'll leave the link to this in the description below. And basically all you have to do is click the Chrome extension here, and then it's going to capture the full page. Once that's done, you can get the picture by going to the downloads. And then what we're going to do is cut off the top part by using this tool and hitting delete. And once you're happy with it, you can go to file and then export as PDF. And we're going to save this and we can use dot PDF. And this is what the result would look like. So as you can see, things are more structured better than if you were to use Notion's own export tool. So this is another way to do this. We hope that this was useful for you. If you're looking for a way to export your Notion pages to PDF, let us know in the comments if you have any questions or anything that was confusing in this video, and we hope to see you in the next one.